Hey all, Hal here <laughs> with more Imperion Galactic Survival. And this is just going to be a little bonus episode for you guys today. Uh, basically what's been going on is that for those who have been following the developer blog, there have been some updates to the game. They've changed a couple of models and um, what I'm going to do is actually show you some of the changes and I've just stopped in here to get some food really quick. Uh, let's go ahead and grab one of these and one of those. Because I don't need a whole lot here. And that should go ahead and cap me up there. Uh, so yeah, but basically what I wanted to do is to show you what, what they've changed. So what they've done is they've now added some new windows, which I haven't actually used yet. I uh, wanted to bring you all in here before I did that. So there is now a new vertical window that is semi-transparent from both interior and exterior. So it's an actual window finally. Um, but what they've done is they've taken the shutters out of it. So there's no more the, the blinds like you see here on these windows. Uh, they have both the vertical, like this one, and the, uh, the sloped without shutters. So we actually will have the ability to put real windows in. Now, I don't know if this means they are going to be less armor. 15 armor, 20 hit points. No, it looks like they're the same. So it's the same of everything. It's just... It's now a two-way transparent, and it doesn't have the shutter. So let's go ahead and learn. Uh, yeah, I've got the point. So let's go, say, let's go ahead and learn these things. I'm surprised it didn't auto unlock. Maybe if I made another level or so, uh, we're gonna make a couple of each of them because I do want to see what they look like. And I may be replacing. Why well, I'm going to replace some of the windows on the uh, the new CV. So we need uh, one glass plate. We have how many metal do we have? Oh, we got plenty of metal components. Okay, so we just need glass plates. So let's go ahead and make, um, I don't know, we'll make 10 glass plates. I'm going to make at least two of these. And let's go ahead and make five of these. Because if I use them, I'm, I'm going to need, actually, let's go ahead and make five of both. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and let that go. With one of the other things that they've done is they have actually recently changed the uh, in-game model for the small power generator that you use on the SVs and HVs. So I went ahead and stripped back some of the, the, the blocks to show you what this thing looks like. It's actually kind of nice. Um, it's following the same motif as the, the fuel cells now. So I'm, I'm really liking this, actually. And let, we'll go in here. We'll power this beast on for you. And I'll show you what it does. Because it does have an animation and a light effect now as well. So we do have, you know, the whole thing. It does rotate just like the other generators. So I'm, I'm really liking the overall look to this. And as you can see, there's a little control panel in there. You know, it's a, nice, a lot of nice little details on it. Um, so I do like the, the new design on that. We are going to go ahead and rebuild the ship, though, because, <laughs> you know me, I don't like having holes in my ship for, you know, what I hope is obvious reasons. Uh, all right, so let's go ahead and put you in there. And we're going to do this. Is that right? Yes. Okay. So that's done. Hopefully the windows will actually be done now as well. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to replace, as you can see, I've already started taking some of the ship apart to do the upgrades. Uh, we've got five and five. That's perfect. Oh, I also need to go turn off <laughs> the EHV because while it doesn't burn a lot of energy, no sense in burning any of the energy that you don't need to, right? All right, so let's go ahead and get back up here to turn my jump jet on anyway because you know reasons right um, I am really enjoying having this CV because of the fact that now that you can turn off the thrusters and it actually does impact your energy um, it makes it nice All right, so let's go ahead and grab these first because we know we're going to use these Ew, fancy and as you can see you can see through them somewhat from the uh, outside. Let's see, how does that look? Eh, I like it. You, you do seem to get a bit more of a field of vision out of it because it's the thin, it looks like the frame is much thinner. Let's go take a look. 
So yeah, the frame is much thinner. Hmm, I may be replacing all of these windows then. See, I do like the idea that these, you know, have the blast shutters on them, but because the the in-game mechanics, since the stats on them are the same, I can't, I'm kind of having trouble justifying not replacing them all. So, um, how about we do this? Let's take this one out. What we'll do is we'll take these three out. Because these are the ones that, if you uh, were piloting, you know, you would really need these to be the ones that you could see out of anyway. Uh, it is interesting because it makes it feel like you don't have windows there. But you can see the difference in the thickness on the edges, so you do end up with a, a slightly better view out of these things. Yeah, I think I'm going to have some fun with these. <laughs> I have ideas. Alright, so let's go ahead and take this out. Uh, well, we actually have enough to take all of these out. I may put back the old windows once I've tried this. But we'll, we'll see how it actually plays out. Alright. And two. And two. And done. Wow, that really changes the feel of the cockpit areas. If they get to, if they ever get where we get the uh, triangular corners for windows, um, yeah, this is going to be awesome. So, devs, if you if you haven't heard already, thank you for the new windows. This these are absolutely amazing. I love the new windows. Um, that is just, wow. That really, really does open up the entire place. So bases now, yeah, that's going to be, that's going to be awesome. But just to show you, you can see the difference in the thickness on the, uh, the frames here. I mean, you, you basically cut that, the frames in half on the edges. Wow, that's that's really really nice I am definitely gonna go ahead and replace the rest of these windows too <laughs> oh so what the last thing I wanted to do really quick was just to come down here grab this and we've already got another one on there so we're not gonna worry too much about that and uh, I'm gonna replace the block here above on the cockpit because I was saying that I needed to put the extra thruster in, so that gives me my my five ascending, five descending, and then five for the uh, on both lateral translations. And so now we have all of our thrusters in place. I need to add that to the to the thruster list, but uh, I do want that. Okay. Go ahead and put that away so we can see again. All right. So, uh, yeah, that's basically it. Like I said, this is more of a bonus episode. It actually ran a little bit longer than I was expecting. Uh, I am going to go ahead and replace the rest of these windows, and I may actually <laughs> replace the windows on the base as well now. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do all of that off camera. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did enjoy it, I hope you uh, will hit that like button. Uh, if you haven't done so already, I do also ask that you subscribe. It will keep you up to date on what's going on with the channel and as I do new things um, and you know honestly both the likes and subscriptions really do help the channel to grow and we have been growing at a phenomenal rate and I just wanted to take a moment and thank everybody for doing that um, like I've said before I know everybody has options as far as you know what you do for content and what you're where you go and spend your time and it is a pleasure and an honor to uh, share my time with you and you just and for you to take the time out of your day to share it with me and I just wanted to, you know, say thank you very much for that. I hope you all have a fantastic day. Uh, happy Thursday to everybody. Hopefully this will be out on Thursday. If not, it'll be <laughs> early on Friday. Uh, so, <laughs> however it plays out, I hope you all have a fantastic day. And uh, yeah, we will see you all back here t either tonight or tomorrow, depending on if it, if today is Friday when you're seeing it <laughs> for the live stream. 
And for everybody else, I hope you have a fantastic weekend. As always, folks, take care and be safe out there.